SpaceX's giant Starship vehicle just took a huge step toward its first ever orbital test flight, which could take place as soon as March this year. A Starship first stage prototype known as Booster 7 ignited 31 of its 33 Raptor engines during a static fire test at SpaceX's Starbase facility in South Texas. Team turned off one engine just before start and one stopped itself, so 31 engines fired overall. But still enough engines to reach orbit. Elon Musk said via Twitter just after the test wrapped up. The static fire lasted about 7 seconds, the duration that SpaceX had mapped out beforehand, according to the company, and Booster 7 emerged from the huge cloud of kicked up dust in one piece, which is something to celebrate as well. During that test mission, the Booster 7 Ship 24 Duo will become the most powerful rocket ever to fly, taking the mantle from NASA's SLS rocket, which debuted November 16th on the agency's Artemis Moon mission. SLS generated 8.8 .8 million pounds of thrust on that liftoff. Super Heavy's 33 Raptors produce about 16.5 million pounds of thrust at full power, according to Spaceflight Now. Booster 7 will come back to Earth in the Gulf of Mexico shortly after liftoff, if all goes according to the test flight plan. Ship 24 will circle our planet once and then splash down in the Pacific Ocean near the Hawaiian island of Kauai. Thanks for watching and subscribe for more.